As part of our celebration of 125 years of Army football, we are counting down the top 10 moments in Army football history. Number 8, Army's 1985 Peach Bowl victory over Illinois. For the second straight year, Army headed to a postseason bowl game against a Big Ten team as the Black Knights faced off against Illinois at a rain-soaked Atlanta Fulton County Stadium on New Year's Eve. The tone was set in the first quarter when Peel Chronister intercepted Illinois quarterback Jack Trudeau, setting up the first points of the game as quarterback Rob Healy broke free on a 22-yard touchdown run to give the Black Knights a 7-0 lead. After 10 straight points by Illinois put the Illini ahead by three, Army bounced back with a Doug Pavick fumble recovery setting up fullback Doug Black to punch it in to put the Black Knights back on top. Another Chronister interception on Illinois' next drive gave Army the ball in Illini territory. It was then time for a bit of razzle-dazzle as running back William Lampley fired a halfback option scoring toss to Benny White to give the Black Knights a 21-10 lead. In the third quarter, Army would find itself down 23-21, and the Black Knights would go back to the option pass to the opposite side. This time it was Clarence Jones to Scott Spellman, and Army was back in the lead 28-23. In the fourth quarter, Army forced another Illini fumble. This time, the Black Knights turned it into three points as a Craig Stopa field goal increased Army's advantage to eight. But Illinois wasn't done. After a desperation touchdown in the final minute, the Illini went for two to tie the game. But again, it was Chronister making the game-saving play, breaking up Trudeau's pass, and sealing Army's second ball victory, defeating Illinois 31-29.